Hey guys, uh, so this is part two of uh, the Destiny exotic weapons for the DLC. Um, I just wanted to quickly say before this video starts, uh, I'm going to be uploading a video tomorrow that is going to be, in my opinion, really cool. So uh, subscribe for that, or it's either tomorrow or Tuesday, so uh, subscribe for that. And, uh, you know, let's uh, kick into this video now. Of our... Ahamkara, Ahamkara, something like that. Look at all this life. Oh, bearer mine. There is so much left to burn. Uh, this is for the warlock again. Attunement, illumination, special weapon loader, increase the special weapon you can carry and stuff. Upgrade defense, snap just discharge, increases melee attack speed. The whispers, uh, gain an additional charge from scorch and energy drain. That is pretty good. So you can use it on uh, Sunsinger or the Voidwalker. Then you have the final three upgrade defenses. Uh, let me... Okay, yeah, I'm the reason I'm cutting it, you know, every clip uh, in between stuff is so I know when to place the picture, and so it changes according. Uh, then you have rune wings. Um, in the garden grows a tree of silver wings. The leaves are rune. The bark is disaster. Of the seeds we do not speak is the uh, statement that goes along with these. You have attunement, illumination, special weapon loader, he uh, upgrade defense. Then you have impact induction, cause causing damage with a melee reduces your grenade cooldown. Then you have seeds of rune. Heavy ammo drops more often and contains more ammo in each drop. That is really good. Uh, this is a. I would definitely recommend trying to get this just because of that alone. Like for the Titan, that would be great. Heavy ammo, more heavy ammo. Can't go wrong with that. Then you have the final three upgrade defenses. All right. Moving on from there, we have Don't Touch Me, which is a gauntlets for the hunted. They look pretty cool. Uh, I like the way they look. They kind of look like the um, no backup plans for the uh, Titan that's currently in the game. To start out, you have attunement. Oh, wait. I forgot to read the little statement. Amputated from a creature that stumbled out of a vex gate. Uh, a vestigial, vestigial, whatever, defense, uh, reflex still remains. Why can I not read that? Whatever. Uh, so to start out, you have attunement, uh, illumination, special weapon loader, upgrade defense, inverse shadow, increase super energy gained from killing minions of the darkness, uh, defensive reflex, uh, taking damage from a melee attack makes you briefly invisible. I don't honestly see that being all too useful because I usually don't let enemies get that close to me. So probably more of a PvE armor, if anything. So doesn't seem very good in my opinion. Then you have the final three upgrade defenses from there. Okay, so then moving on from there. By the way, if I sound sick, uh, I just kind of noticed I do sound sick because uh, I just watched a little bit of a playback thing. Um... It's because I am, and well, you guessed it, I, I am sick. So, from there, we have nothing manacles, manacles, yeah, something like that, and it's um, gauntlets for the uh, warlock. They look like sunbreakers, but blue. The equations balance thus. You are diminished, and I am exalted. Uh, you are broken, and I am made strong. So, you to start out, you have attunement, illumination, special weapon loader, Upgrade defense, serpent's tail, causing damage with a melee, reduces your grenade cooldown. Then you have the cold equation, kills with void light ability, grants a shield. Okay, so, uh, yeah, that seems pretty cool. Uh, I don't really have anything else to say about it. I probably won't use it uh, if I ever get it, but so there's that. And then you have the final three upgrade defenses. And moving on again. We have ACD uh, forward slash zero feedback fence. These are gauntlets for the Titan. Look pretty cool. Um, to start out, you, the active contact defense system uses a Warsat Hall materials to store a r relatory charge, I guess. Yeah. Uh, two mint, then you have illumination, special weapon loader, upgrade defense. Rain blows, which is uh, increasing uh, melee speed. Then you have wraith uh, wraith conductors, 
Taking damage from a melee attack deals damage in an area around you. So I guess like it'll send a pulse out from your feet and uh, damaging enemies around you. And then you had the final three upgrade defenses. Seems pretty cool. Uh, probably won't use it though. So yeah. From there you had the final gauntlets, which is let me pop this open. Slide this over there. Um, a car hecka's uh, hooks. Yeah, I don't know how to say it. They're uh, they're for the what is it, hunter. Um, and the statement says, ah, no matter. The world, the wound is not so deep. Uh, to start out, you have attunement, you have illumination, special weapon loader, upgrade defense, ashes to asset, asset uh, replenishes super energy when you get a kill with a grenade, uh, touch of venom, hitting an enemy with a melee attack while invisible deals additional damage over time. So not very useless is what they're saying, or not very useful, I should say. And then you say, and then it's upgrade defense. For the rest, yeah, last three are upgrade defenses, as usual. Moving on from there, we only have, let's see, yeah, f five, four, five more things to do. Um, you have the Mark 44 Stand Asides. This is uh, for the Titan, and it says, pardon me, coming through. Uh, attunement, illumination, heavy weapon ammo. What does this say? I can't, I can't read that. It's off the screen. Uh... Yeah, uh, upgrade defense. Then you have be somewhere else. Increase the duration of your shoulder charge remains active. And then you have upgrade defense for the last three. Not many things on there, but that's fine. They're boots. No one really cares about boots. Uh, again, moving on, you have. Radiant Dance Machine, which, uh, wow, I, huh, what, what, I'm not actually sure if this is for the, uh, it looks more like a hunter thing, but, uh, built for swift movement, they provide unexpected and decisive, uh, social benefits, that, okay, alright, well, I'll leave it as that, uh, attunement and illumination, the thing is, uh, attunement has a little Titan logo in it, but Illumination has the uh, the Hunter logo, so that's why I'm not sure, really. Then you have Heavy Weapon Ammo, Upgrade Defense, The Dance. You move more quickly while aiming your weapon. All right, so I would not recommend using this. At all costs, try to avoid using this, because this, unless you're, like, doing it for PvP, I really would not use this, because that's not very useful. And then you have the final three, Upgrade Defense. Um... Then you have Unremarkable Bones. They are, again, they look more like a... Surely the warlocks cling to these fossils for a reason. What could it be? Oh, bear mine. Again, they say something about warlocks in the little statement, but then for attunement, they show a titan symbol, and then for illumination, they show a hunter symbol. I think these are hunter boots, though, because there's another part where they it shows a hunter. Um, heavy weapon ammo, upgrade defense, and not bound by law. Upgrades double jump with an additional jump. De okay, so what? Wait, isn't that, isn't that just a triple jump on the... What? That's just a triple jump. Or maybe you'll jump higher, I don't know. But yeah, definitely for the hunter. And then you have the final three upgrade defenses. Didn't really make much sense there, but uh, whatever. Again, moving on. You have the final thing. Actually, there's one more. Uh, per, per green greaves? Per green greaves? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, whoa. What is all of this? What the? Holy. All right. Wow. Uh definitely I would suggest looking at this link I'm gonna put this one in the description definitely I'll put a little star by it in the description so you can know what I'm talking about but it says victory on from on high okay victory from on high um, the first thing it says random the skill could be one of the following and there's six different little mini circles that it doesn't tell me what they are it just says it just shows like a little 
like bungee little logo thing. I'm not sure what they're called. It doesn't tell me what it could be. And then it says illumination, which uh, is what we've, yeah. Um, then we move on. The second skill set says random. Uh, the skill could be one of the following, and it says auto rifle ammo, scout rifle ammo, hand cannon ammo, and pulse rifle ammo. So at this point, it'll be one of the following four items. So completely random. You're not sure, really. Then upgrade defense. Then... Pergrim Strike, Pergrind Strike, uh, Shoulder Charge deals bonus damage when activated in the air, and then you have Upgrade Defense for the final three. That is pretty, pretty cool. I like that, actually. That uh, The fact that they have that little random thing in there, I really like that they did that. Alright, guys, the final thing here is the crux, crux of Crota, and it's a material... And it says, their god is now our power. So I'm assuming there is going to be upgrade materials in the next update that'll, um, you'll use it to upgrade armor and weapons, and this is one of them. So that's my take on that. Uh, and that's, that's all there is for that. There's nothing else that it says for that or anything. But guys, hope you enjoyed this video very long video for normally what I do and um, you know that that's all there is uh, they're adding other stuff still but that the list oh the video it would be crazy long there's over a hundred legendaries they're adding but thank you guys for watching this video don't forget if you want to see any of the uh, items I'll put a link to each individual item in the description below so feel free to check that out and uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And you know what, guys? Um, thank you. I, that's it. Thank you. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.